Hello, hello. I hope you're having a great Friday. Today, I want to talk about Now or Never's experience at the One Love Lunar Solar Eclipse Festival. We had such a great time performing at the festival. I have literally nothing but good things to say about the festival. The only downsides that there was was for us driving out to Kamul, California. For where I am, it was a little over a two hour drive. So we did have to wake up very early in the morning to get there at least within an hour before we were set to go on stage because that was kind of the deal that you have to at least be there an hour before you perform so that this way the stage manager and the people running the festival knew that each band was going to be there and be able to perform during their designated set times. So aside from waking up at like 6 a.m., because I'm not a morning person, it was such a hard time for me to wake up at 6 a.m., especially since I had work the night before. And since I got off rather late at work, that kind of put me going to bed rather later. And having to wake up at 6 a.m. made me a very, very tired person the next morning. But nonetheless, I was still excited to play the One Love Lunar Solar Eclipse Festival. So of course, I got up bright and early. I got ready, I did my hair. I loaded up the car the night before just so that was one less thing that we had to worry about. And then my mom, my girlfriend came over, then we drove on over to pick up Jer, and that's where we set off the journey for Hamul, California. We left probably at 8 o'clock, a little bit before. We all tried to eat breakfast before, and then we got to Hamul, or probably 10.30, almost 11. We got there with just enough time for us to check in, to find out who we had to talk to, find out where we were going to perform and all of that stuff so it was a journey getting there just because we had to wake up so early and then when we did get there the only like one bad thing I guess I can say about it was our set list did get cut drastically short we only played three songs which sucks since we did prepare six songs for the set since we were supposed to have a 30 minute set didn't really happen but I'm not mad about it we're not gonna complain we're not gonna trash anyone because it was still a good time and for whatever reasons we had to play three songs songs it's okay we still had a blast and we want to thank George from Odalon and Carolyn who owns the Good Vibes Ranch for inviting us out we had such a nice time and even though we only played three songs all the rest of the bands who performed that night were such troopers because it started raining both days of the festival but the band still continued to perform so I was just blown away by the dedication of everyone who put the festival together to the bands performing it was just such a great time I'm so glad I got to perform. I got to network. I got to meet other bands. I got to see old faces, new faces. It was such a great time and we cannot wait to play again. One final thing I want to say about the One Love Festival was being able to watch all the bands perform, listening to the bands play. It just made me just really reminisce and miss the days of now or never having a drummer and a synthesizer. So I am now on a mission to make now or never a band again. In 2024, now or never will have a drummer and a bass player mark my words because now I will be going to more open mics it's gonna happen that's my goal I'm gonna start performing at open mics I'm gonna try to meet more musicians I'm gonna try to make now or never a band again because just after going to that festival and watching the bands perform and just watching how much fun they had just looking like just it was so cool just to see the bands watching perform it reminded me of the time when now or never was a band and it just reminded me how badly I want to be in a, in a band again and that's why Now or Never is going to open mics. We're going to play, we're going to get some traction, we're going to get some bandmates because that is the goal for 2024. That's also all I have to say for the One Love Lunar Solar Eclipse Festival. Thank you guys for watching. Also, if you have not watched our set from that festival, be sure to go watch it now because it was uploaded last Friday. So if you haven't watched it, go watch that now after watching this video so you can see which three songs we got to play and how good we sound. All right, thanks for watching. Keep streaming Now or Never's music wherever you do. All right, I love you. Bye.